Gaddafi, the longest Arab dictator, allegedly ordered the bombing of a U.S. airliner over Lockerbie, Scotland. He is dead. He's the latest in a string of high-profile terrorist leaders that have been killed since the death of Osama bin Laden last May. Question is, with Gaddafi dead and gone, what about Syria? What about Iran? What about Egypt? Let's talk. We have retired U.S. Army General and former NATO Supreme Allied Commander Wesley Clark and Dan Senor, Senior Fellow for Middle Eastern Studies, Council on Foreign Relations. General Clark, welcome back, as Thank always. Thank you, Larry. Uh, I just want to ask you, sir, first of all, who is the National Transitional Council? They're the alleged uh, guys that are going to run the country. Are we really talking freedom and democracy here? Is it going to be that straightforward? Well, I think we've got a chance to establish some freedom and democracy there. It's a chance. There's a lot of, there's a lot of different groups. There's a lot of friction. There's a lot of uh, anger that's built up. There's a lot of uncertainty about this. But, yes, we've got a chance.